How can you create meaningful goals and intentions that will propel you to success? In this video, I'm going to talk to you about how you can create positively framed goals that will help you propel you towards success rather than just focusing so much on what you're trying to avoid in your life. So let's jump into it. When it comes to creating positively framed goals that will, will propel us towards success, the key word here is intention. The intentions that we have of what we're trying to go accomplish and who we're trying to become is what propels us towards the life that we want to live. Now, there are two types of orientations we can have, and we might call this an approach orientation, which means we're mostly growth oriented. We're willing to take appropriate risks in order to achieve or have the potential to reach the opportunity. Now, that doesn't mean things are guaranteed that they're going to be successful, but we have the, the chance of a better future. Conversely, sometimes we might have what's called an avoidance orientation, which means that we are driven primarily by the fear of risks that are involved and the fear of failure right? We don't want to lose. We don't want to miss out on something. We want to, don't want to be found out. And so we mostly focus on maintaining what we have now. So which approach do we think is more intentional and more likely to actually lead to success? Probably don't have to think too much about this. Yes, it's that approach orientation. Because your goals and the focus of your life will be much more powerful if you're focused on what you're moving towards and what you want rather than what you're trying to move away from or avoid. Because as Tony Robbins says, energy flows where attention goes, right? So this comes to life in many career development conversations that I have with people who express their need for help. When I ask what they want in their careers, they often tell me what they don't want. Instead, they tell me things like, I wanna get out of this bureaucracy in, in my company. I don't wanna feel so stuck in the role that I'm in now. I feel like I'm really getting pigeonholed here. I need to get away from my narcissistic manager. My current company is imploding and I need to get out of here. I, I don't want to stop to keep getting passed over for promotions and on and on and on, right? So instead, all, all of these things that they were telling me are things that they're trying to avoid or they want to get out of, right? But that doesn't really propel them towards action. Instead, we work with them to craft goals and intentions on what they really want. And that changes to things like, I want to have a role that allows me to unleash my creativity and my innovative ideas. I want to experience growth in my particular skills as well as my income by a certain amount. Right? I want to work for a company that's stable and growing so that I can feel secure in my role there. I'd love to work for a supportive leader that promotes collaboration and psychological safety, where I want to be able to learn how to present my value in a meaningful way so that management decides to promote me so that I can increase the positive influence that I can have on my team. These are just a few examples, but you can see that these are much more approach oriented. They're helping describe the type of outcome that they are trying to accomplish, not just what they're trying to avoid. And now they can start moving towards that reality by taking the actions that will help them get there. So I invite you to reflect, are you more approach oriented or more avoidance oriented? And if you tend towards the more avoidance orientation, how can you change those things that you're trying to avoid in a more positively framed goal and intention that will help you propel you towards the success that you want to achieve. My name is Jeff Perry. I'm a leadership and career development expert, and I love helping engineers and technology professionals like you to live a life and a career with intention. I would love to help you design your life and career and create goals and intentions that will propel you towards success that you would look forward to and get excited about. If I can help in any way, please reach out and let's connect, and I look forward to talking soon.